canvas and paint in my mind. Colors dance, spread outside the lines. I refuse to settle, never the black and white. Rock the neons until the day I die. I'm on a constant search to make my heart swell. Bite off too much. Tonight, what I have for you is the mini album teapot that Deb sells in the store. It's GA458. It's the Fab Scraps teapot mini album. And I went ahead and papered pretty much all of it so we wouldn't have to sit here and wait for that to dry. But I did leave the back page undone so I could show you how I did the wrap around pocket like that so I'm going to show you how I did that one What I did was, this is the circle that goes on the mini album, and I just drew a circle, the bottom half about where I want, then I made this three inches wide, this way, and then what I'm going to do is, after I punched it out with a Martha Stewart punch, I'm just going to cut this down in a circle. Well, a half circle, I guess you would call it. Like that. And then for it to lay right, I just came in. And made little nips all the way around Phew. I haven't had a hot flash all day and now one of you hit me I might have to open my window then make sure you place what you want face down on the mark that you made and just fold them up since this isn't going to show I just Use a little hot glue and stick them down real quick. And then to adhere it to our album, I just use some score tape. Deb has this in their shop. I don't have the number written down for this one. added security I put a little bit of fabric tack in between the score tape just to make sure it doesn't pull away from the album and since I wrapped this around it's got an extra layer behind it with the little cutouts on the card the chipboard part it's a an all-day job to get these all cut out but you could if you didn't want to you could always just cut an extra disc and cover it like that if you wanted to 
but I like the look of the gold. I couldn't find silver paper, so I had to use a piece of gold. Okay. And so now we get to decorate. Um, I even did the back using the A4 Tales of You and Me from Prima paper that Deb has. This one came out of its bag, Deb. I don't know the number. Sorry. How's everybody doing tonight? I hope Deb's safe. I don't. I haven't been watching the news to even see how close Matthew is going to be to her. I know a couple of our members have checked in that they're okay, so that's good. photo mats earlier and just stick a couple in there I have something special I want to do for the top but I'll have to do that last after we've decorated everything okay. Okay, this next page back we need flowers on that one. Okay, these are the GA380 1.5 inch soft foam baby pink roses. These roses are gorgeous. I use them almost on every project. GA379 White Foam Roses. GA349 Ruffled Tool Faux Pearl Trim. You want to watch your holes so you can still have room to put your book rings in at the end. When you have trims like this and the gimp trim, you put some glue down and hold it till it dries. It'll keep it from unraveling. I think this is GA116 six petal elongated pearl and stone. And to make sure you don't stick your pocket closed, just put a piece of scratch paper behind it. I believe this is called 3D Flower. I don't have the number for it. I think this is my last piece. I'm just trimming off the arms. It's gorgeous. You could take this off and add a different kind of center and then you would have another flower so GA69 pink and green facet lamp work bead they have little roses in them they're gorgeous they're beautiful on stick pins too GA 
This is GA184 Double Edged Rose Lattice Lace. I used it on um, my last project, I think, with the piano, I think is the one I used it on. Oh, it was beautiful. GA289 White Enamel Flower Cluster. It's gorgeous. I think these come in pink. They're gorgeous. I got a lot of sparkle and shine. Can never have too much shine. Never ever. Jody, it's the you and, Tales of You and Me. Deb has it in her shop. Um, it's by Prima. It is gorgeous. It's nice and soft. Cool beans. All right. There's that page. The belly band. GA802 Pink Pearl Beaded Trim. This one comes in white, Jody, as well. But I like the pink. Pink is my favorite color. This is going to be the GA320 Vintage Style Rhinestone Metal Embellishment. It comes with that you can strap string through there and make a bracelet out of it. It's gorgeous. I had to order me some more. I might have to make me a bracelet. A473 mini doily appliques. And put two of these down so the this is heavy. We'll have uh, something to grasp onto with the I'm gonna use uh, beacon the fabric tack that Deb sells in the store. I use that to put down everything. Of course. Out of glue. I'll just tack these down with a hot glue right now. But I will come back in with the fabric tack and put them back on permanent. Love that. I hope she has more of those in the store. I need to get me some more of those. I can make another pocket. All right, there you have it. That's what we're doing. Making another pocket. Deb, I didn't write this down either. I'm gonna fire me, right? I don't. I didn't write it down. Sorry, but it's the it's black and gold. Beautiful, I knew that. Yeah, you can relax with Teresa's on because she don't talk very much. She doesn't bother anybody, huh? I'm trying to get better at it. I really am. Take it off. Start over. I wasn't paying attention. We have Maybe I'll put over that. Mm -hmm. All right. This is GA two nine two. Pink with tan S-shape trim. This is so pretty. It's dainty. Probably should have put this on that baby sweater I made. I forgot about it. I forgot I had it.
I'm usually the first Friday of the month, I think is what the schedule said. I could be wrong. It may change. I don't know. Deb will answer your question for you. Um, Deborah, I don't know. Um, I want to say I'm the first <clears throat> Friday of the month. There's that page. This is GA319 Teardrop Dangle Lace. GA696 Loopy Lace bead trim black. GA855 faux pearl, faux pink and pearl rhinestone five petal flower. And now we're to the front of the album. Okay, I think I might just put a couple flowers on the front. Because the... Well, wait a minute. Let's see. Yeah, there's not going to be any room on the teapot itself. So, we'll put flowers... A cluster of flowers on the front of the teapot and then I'll show you what I'm special I'm going to do for the top of this thing but I'll have to do that off camera because it will make a mess and I have excuse me to leave it sit for a while to let it dry Okay, so let's see. Eight three three round rhinestone and belly pink. Then I'll put some week of Stella on the flowers to make them shimmer a lot more. There's that page. Okay, let's figure out where the book rings went. Hmm. And put it together and see what we got. There they are. When you buy the mini from Deborah, from Deb, I was thinking of somebody else. When you buy the mini from Deb, it comes with the book rings. Maybe I can get them open. Oh, okay, there's one. And there's two, okay. Right. Let's see, how am I going to do this? It's going to be easier to go this way. That's the front of the teapot. The next page. That page. There's that. Then the page with the belly band. And a plain page just to add a picture to. Which one am I going in? I'm at the top or the bottom? I'll have this all janked up in a minute. And then the back page. Okay. 
And here's the back of the teapot. them up a little bit to get it in there. There we go. Come on, come on, come on. Alright. Ouch. Alright. Did I do that wrong? No, it's right. Okay. Alright. I think I might end up taking the book rings out and using um steam binding but what I want to do what I will do after I go off is I'm going to use the glass glitter from Deb's shop it's called make mine pink blend and I'm going to put glossy accents down and then sprinkle this all around it and let it dry and then I'll do the other side as well that is my project for this month my class. I hope y'all liked it. Hmm. I might have to put a feather on it. I just don't know. What do you think? Feather or no feather? I'm kind of crushing on it on that side, huh? Yeah, I think that's where its home will be after I get the glitter, the glue, and everything. Check out Deb's shop. She's going to run me to the poorhouse, but it's going to be fun getting there. All right. Thanks for coming out, everybody. Y'all have a good weekend. Take care of yourselves.